let's work a few simple circuits. We have a very uh, simple circuit here where I have a power supply, a battery, given off a voltage of 24 volts, and we connect across it a resistor up. Now, um, the direction of the current is going to be from the positive lead of the battery to the negative lead, as shown here. Uh, now, of course, remember that the, car, uh, the electrons actually flow the opposite direction, because the electrons are going to come from the negative lead. They're going to flow from the opposite direction than the direction of the current. Okay, now, the question here is asking for the current when the voltage is 24 volts and the resistance is 8 ohms. Just to be clear here, we are going to take our time. I'm going to erase first these markings that I added. Okay. Now I'm going to show on the circuit the places that have the same electrical potential. So this, all at the same electrical potential. In the other side, All of this is at the same electrical potential. The difference between both of these is the difference between what we have here, which is given here as 24 volts, which tells us that the resistance is subject to a voltage difference of 24 volts, or VR is equal to 24 volts. And the voltage across the resistance is given by Ohm's law. So this should be written as R times I. Solvent for I. I is going to be VR over R. And in this case, it's going to be 24 volts over 8 ohms. 3 amps. Okay. Now... What if our battery, like real batteries, has an internal resistance of 1 ohm? What would be the current? Now, when we say that the battery has an internal resi uh, resistance, it's like saying that my circuit is actually like this. This is the resistance of the battery. This is E the 24 volts that's given here, and this is my circuit. So the overall battery, what we see from the outside, is going to be what's in between this dashed box. Now, in this case, if I use the colors at, uh, as I used last time, this is at the same voltage. This is at the same voltage. And then we have a third voltage here. So the 24 volts that's given here, it's between the battery ends, but it is between both the internal resistance of the battery and the resistance that we are connecting to the battery. So actually, 24 volts is going to be our equivalent, the overall equivalent resistance of the circuit, times I. And R equivalent, since R and R are in series, they are in the same branch, it's going to be just the same of resistances. So I is just 24 volts over 8 ohm plus 1 ohm. So 24 over 9 amps. Now, if I didn't have the resistance, 
outside, then I will have no current through this resistor here. And the voltage then, since I have no current, the internal resistance is not going to result in a voltage drop. So if I take a voltmeter and take a measurement of the voltage across the battery, I'm going to be able to read that E, 24 volts. It's only when I connect it to a circuit that I'm going to read a smaller voltage. What voltage am I going to read when it is connected to the circuit? Now, the difference between the yellow and the green. The voltage I'm going to read is going to be 24 volts minus the voltage drop across small r, minus V small r. And what's V small r? It's going to be 1 ohm times the current. So it's going to be 24 volts minus 24 over 9 amps times 1 ohm. So this is the voltage that we measure across the real battery in this case. One more case dealing with batteries. What if uh, the wires, like real wires, have also an internal resistance? To deal with that, all what we have to do is, this is my ideal battery, 24 volts. This is the internal resistance of the battery. So this is my battery, and this probably should have been written RW. And then for the wire, I'm going to replace it by a small resistance RW here. And I'm drawing ideal wires, and this is my resistance. So the 24 volts, in this case, It's going to see the overall resistance of the circuit, which is going to be R plus RW plus R times I. So my I is going to be 24 volts over 8 ohms plus 1 ohm plus uh, 0.5 ohms. So it's going to be over 9.5 ohms. That would be my current. 